I guess as any skier, you're always looking for powder, and Chatter Creek here is renowned for some of the best pow in the world. I kind of had it in my mind of big pillows, lots of snow. World-class terrain, some of the best terrain that I've ever been around and slided in. But it's the end of March, and it feels like the end of May right now. We've been super lucky with the amount of sunshine we're getting, but it's kind of made the snowpack not really sendable, so we went to plan B. <laughs> this is spring break 2013. I think it's about to get ridiculous. Uh, sure, it's gonna come off here pretty soon. And we're gonna do crowd pleasers off a wind lift. Crowd pleasers are back lips for the non-spring breakers. So with Josh Duak being out here, uh, he's in a sit ski and uh, he's absolutely shredding on it and he kind of wanted to show us what it's like. It's nice to see anybody learn from the beginning again because it reminds me of the, the essence and the beauty of the sport of sit skiing. I don't need two skis anymore. All I need is just one in a chair. I give Josh a lot of credit because that was probably one of the harder things I've ever done. That's pretty inspiring what he was able to do with that sit ski. trips like this in the mountains, you know, conditions aren't always ideal, but if you poke your head around long enough and look around, you're always bound to find something good. Just happened. Yeah.